There have not been any advisories. In fact, the wind is helping limit those dense patches of fog. Still, any decrease in visibility can make for difficult and potentially dangerous driving conditions. You might have experienced it yourself the last couple of nights and early mornings. The fog so thick at times, making it tough to drive, let alone see what's right in front of you. DPS reminding drivers not to use their high beams. The reason? Fog is made up of tiny water droplets which act like a mirror and reflect light back. More light means more reflection and in turn lower visibility. It can also be blinding for motorists driving in the opposite direction. It's a lot harder for the opposite vehicle to see when you're driving with your high beams on. So it's recommended to drive with your low beams. If your vehicle has some type of fog lights, make sure they're active. That also helps out when you're driving in the fog. Keep in mind, reaction time during fog events can be limited. TxDOT says there is lighting over the JFK as well as the Harbor Bridge to help guide motorists. So far, there have not been any accidents associated with this fog. Reporting from Padre Island, Bill Churchwell. Three news.